Hello and welcome back to E4 and Early Rect. Uh, this is going to be a quick episode because we're only going to invade Holstein. That will be the end of the episode and also the end of the recording session for me, which would be quite nice. Uh, we don't have any truces, they have no allies. This will be a quick and easy war. Um... We'll take it. Right, let's do this. Perfect. Sorted. This is going to be a really quick war. This is really we're, This is not going to be a long episode at all. But what we're going to do is we're going. I'm going to take Holstein personally, and I'm going to give Slizvik Slizvik to Denmark, my ally, the vassal. Uh, and that'll be fine. Yeah. I don't know where the other two are. Oh dear, no, that's not them. <laughs> they're, they're just gone. And your true trade, your ugh, your two trade galleons getting repaired. That's fine. Um, right. Let's get let's get a template for ten. Army. Have I? I don't know if I've used this yet. I don't know if I have. Basically, you set up like your own units. Uh, we'll go for six six infantry, four uh cavalry, and more sets so that we can use up all the provinces that. We can, that'll do. That'll do for 13. And when they have built, we'll uh, go into debt, of course, but that'll be fine. Because I'm not planning on going to any more wars. Be nice to no longer have a mercenary army. Uh, oh god, why are we in stability drop? Why have we got no stability all of a sudden? I didn't break a truce, did I? Uh, I don't know. Must have. Oh, you had a truce with us. Why did you do that? <laughs> I don't know why I did that. <gasps> oh, sh it's because I had military access. Fuck. Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh, God, I should have cancelled that. Well, I used up all my admin getting that repaired. Right, uh. National unrest, I'll do. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> that will help for a little bit. National unrest plus one missionary. Yeah, that's not going to happen. Oh, we don't need it yet. Oh. Oh, yeah, could you build new units? Of course you will. Let's get a military advisor back as well. Uh, Hopefully that won't take too long. Yeah. Whew. God, that was annoying and scary. Glory to God! I'm not gonna read it. I'm not gonna read it. <laughs> I don't want to read it. Uh, and we'll build a coinage there. I said we'll build one there. Do we get a free leader? Of course we do. Oh well, yeah, well, yeah, we do. <laughs> get a, an admiral for our good navy. Uh, let's call it the navy. In the navy, oh, god damn it! I just knew I was going to sing that. The navy. Okay, Denmark's just sitting there, like, yeah, don't mind us. We're just going to have a little VT out. Although I just realised it because we tell them vassal, it's broken their uh, union with Norway. Of course it has. Norway's independent. Won't last that long. It's just giving Sweden the right to uh to uh. To, why does Sweden hate us now? Uh, yeah, fine, go with that. They want to own Denmark. Because they want to form Scandinavia. Don't worry, we can kill them pretty easily. We're quite strong now. Quite. We're very strong now. Although we do really want to get out of this terrible stability. Because these guys are going to rise up soon. I'm going to use up, actually, going to use up some of my uh, mill. Milliliters. Get them down. Uh, oh! A nice pop up! <laughs> The Pragmatic Sanction, solemnly rendered by the Emperor Charles the Sixth on the 19th of April 1713, oh, three years off, established the invisibility of the Had Habsburg patrimony and ruled the order of succession by order of the firstborn child, even to a woman. This made Maria Theresa, born in 1717, the heir to of the empire. 
The pragmatic sanction was recognised by Spain in 1725, confirmed in 1731, Russia in 1726, Prussia in 1728, the United Provinces in 1731, Hanover Hanover in 1732, the Holy Roman Empire, except Bavaria, in 1732, and France in 1738. Bavarian's refusal would lead to the War of Austrian Succession. Oh, well, there you go. Pragmatic Sanction. I don't know what that means. Yeah, screw you, Bavaria! I'm pretty sure we destroyed you when I was playing Austria, but yeah, whatever. <laughs> yeah, we had that war a bit too early, if you ask me. Uh, should have just waited until we had the sanction come up. Whatever. Oh, well. Sweden. Sweden. Oh, God, we're going to have to have a war with Sweden, aren't we? Look how powerful they are. We don't need to do any invasions of Sweden. That's the thing. So we just need to break it up. Give Norway back its land and take Finland out. Well, give get Finland independence. Finless. Finless independence. Finless independence. <laughs> Uh, I wonder how many people have actually, like, been Finland. I've always wondered that. Who's in the war? No one, just Oldenburg and Denmark. Fine. And they're not really doing a lot either. At all. Uh, you got a lot of autonomy. How You should have none. You don't have any good. Uh, when can we reduce you? 1487. That's a while away. Oh, I should have probably read that. I didn't even look at it. Whatever. Oh, it's because we took the province. Fine. You stay there, keep that going. We are in decks, we are building, we have got nearly tr double our force limit, that's fine. In fact, we can just, right, what we're going to do is going to take you there. You go there. And you go away. That's fine. I don't see anything wrong with that. We can get another 14, so I'm going to not build a one of five. Uh, I'm going to wait until that army's going to be built, and then we'll get the extra four. Do that. Trade speed against Pomenaria. Well, that's not going to go well for you. I'm the Hansa. Who else is in the war with her? The... Hold on, let's... who else is in the uh, coalition? They are allied with Riga in Holland. They'll call them on the coalition. Pomenaria, Brunswick, Bremen, and Munster. Right, that's fine. Almost kicked declared war then. <laughs> that would have been hilarious. That would not have been horrible. Oh, the horsemen haven't been built yet. Why do I keep calling them horsemen? God, yeah, the horsemen. Mm. God's sake. Anyway, this shouldn't take too much longer. Too much longer. This shouldn't take much longer. Too much longer. It's going to be the same. That's my logo. Too much longer. Doesn't make any sense, but I'll be the same. Don't question it. Just go with it. Ugh. We are just waiting now. We are literally just, we're just gonna wait. It's fine. It's fine. Calm down. Denmark is building quite a big army. I think their army is gonna be. Ugh. I think their army's force limit is smaller than ours because they have got. They're missing quite a bit of their land. I might just take Slesvig and Holstein, keep Denmark quite small and manageable. I really don't want them to get a bit too powerful. A bit too much power. Wait, what? We didn't lose it on 30. That one did we? No, we lost it on Stadium, yes. And no. Oh, that is weird. Look at that. It reminds me of that. Uh, Oh, never mind. <laughs> what did we lose it on? Oh, yeah, it was on Mecklenburg. That was a long time ago then. But, yeah, it would have been like nearly 40 years by now. 40 years now. Uh, how's the papacy going? Get uh, some money. Mono oh, interest. Or we can get uh, papal influence. Oh, no. Get an uh, advisor or something. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, we don't have. A uh, Hanseanic Cardinal anymore. 300 ducats or trade efficiency. Trade efficiency. Definitely. Uh, oh. Always trade efficiency. All oh, the saving. Come on. Be the month. No. Water shortage. Shortage. Even though they are surrounded by water. Actually, that's ocean, so it's probably salty. Oh, the Iberian weddings happened. Oh, wow. Aragon. I like it, the Iberian weapon. Uh, the, I I <laughs> the Iberian weapon. <laughs> ah, we've got an all command and conquer on us now. No. Uh, <laughs> the Aragon, Aragon and Castile have had the wedding. So they're now a union. And that's great. Because it means that we're going to have a nice formal Spain. Colonising America. Okay. Well, 
the the islands of the new world. I'm not really sure it's going to be America. Uh, that's almost done. That might be done. Come on. Oh my god. It's been on 21% for an hour. Like, hours now. Felt hats. Ah! Oh, beaver fur is an excellent material for hat making. It keeps warmth and can hold its shape well. Even in rough weather. And over long times. Raising demand for felt hats along with the complicated process involved in making them has led to the growth of a healthy hat making sector of the economy. Oh god, what do you want? Oh, we're, we're, we've done it. We're, um, I am, do not want to lose more... I can't take any more stability. Right. Finalization, what would that take? That would... That wouldn't be that bad, actually. People who already hate us will lose quite a bit, but... No, I don't think we can do that. Right. Because it's going to finally axe them. And, um... Well, that's a good reason for us to give it to Denmark. You've already got a core on it as well, so... You, you also got... You don't have a core on this, though. Right, then. Oh, my God. Isn't that the modern-day borders of Denmark? I'm pretty sure it is. Oh, no, maybe they have Skane. I don't know. I won't actually check now. Oh, well, anyway. We have just... We've dealt with Holstein. Holstein's gone, and uh, the Danish have... a. Wow, well, that's it. Denmark. Done. One of our main goals has been completed. Denmark has been destroyed. We don't fully own them, but we have, we do control them, which is what we wanted. So thank you for watching, everyone. Uh, oh, God, we need to fix some hours. Well, I suppose Sweden hates this already. And I suppose... Um, <sighs> Norway. Norway. Go on, then. Scandinavia. Next on the list. Haha. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, we're forming Germany, but we're going to invade Scandinavia. Don't question it, we're going to do it. Right, thanks for watching everyone. Hope you enjoyed. Next episode, we'll hopefully have, it'll be long enough for us to take Denmark. If not, we'll be warring down for this area. Anyway, thanks for watching everyone. If I don't do another video before Christmas, I hope you have a Merry Christmas, a Happy New Year, and see you next year if I don't do a video. Otherwise, see you later. Goodbye. Bye.